Hi guys. Uh, and I get a good shot of these two. Um, if you guys follow me on Instagram or Facebook, you've already seen their name reveal. Um, this. There we go. Um, this is going to be the name reveal. I already did a box opening, and um, in the box opening, there was some stuff missing. So I contacted the seller, and the seller did send it. Um, the only big disappointment is one of the babies did not have um, either batteries. There's supposed to be two rechargeable batteries in it and one of them had this jinky battery um why i say jinky is because um this is not the original battery that's supposed to come with them um my daughter's hair all over this is the plug that's supposed to go into them into their computer boards and this is the correct wiring for said baby and there was only one of these and this battery plugged into it and it was like wrapped around this part was wrapped around so and then this was like jinkly like they had it connected horribly bad and it wasn't even soldered or anything the wires were just twisted together and then they took electrical tape and just wrapped it around. And it looks like the bad, the original battery went bad. And instead of getting one rebuilt, they bought a battery that they thought would work and tried to make it work. And it didn't. So, um, unfortunately, neither of these guys have batteries. I did, however, plug both of them in. And you are able to run them plugged in constantly because there's no battery to charge um you aren't able to run a full demo on them but um i was able to plug both of them in and run diagnostic on both of them and both of them the computer boards completely work and the dolls themselves are in pretty good shape um this little guy, you probably won't be able to see. There's a few little black marks on his hand and his one leg. They look like newspaper touched him at some point. Um, but I'm just going to have, I'll just get some Oxy-10 and that'll take care of that. Um, and this little guy's in pretty good shape. He's got a little bit of dirt spot on his nose, so I might Oxy his nose a little bit. And all I did was take a quick wipe down with a baby wipe to both of them and both of them smell like the baby powder scent from when you first initially get one brand new so that was a huge plus um eventually after i get the battery remade this little guy will be up for sale um i haven't decided yet if i'm going to sell him with luna or if i'm going to sell him separately that I haven't decided yet. Um, if Luna sells without him, I, um, if Luna sells without this little guy, um, then I'll get an X stick for him and sell him separately, but I haven't fully decided what to do with him. Um, this one will be staying. I did name both of them just because, like I said, I didn't know how long he's going to be staying with us. Um, as most of you know, I'm not a huge fan of the Caucasian sculpt, and now I have four of them. Um, so, I would prefer to sell him and Luna to get um, two other babies I don't currently have. So, um, I'd really like to, per, pretty much selling Luna is to get a Real Care 3 and to help pay for my kid's dance. Um... And then him probably sell to get another baby. I think I looked and I only have four babies left now that I have this one. Um, two African-American, that light and dark males, and then a Japanese girl and a Hispanic girl. So that is all that I am missing now from my collection. 
But anyways, probably tuning in for the actual name reveal. Um, and since I might be selling him with Luna, I decided to kind of change his birthday around. So he'll be Luna's twin. Uh, okay. And his name is Holden Levi. Um, it's, well, most of you probably don't know. My husband um, was in the military. Well, he's in the military. He's in the guard. And um, he deployed to Iraq in 2008. And I believe it was the year before he deployed, there was a show that started on Lifetime called Army Wives. And that quickly became my best friends and my, as soon as my husband deployed, we started watching it and both of us became obsessed with it. Like every Sunday night, even after my son was born, we would go over to their house and so her and I could watch Army Wives together. Um, and there was a character, or there was two characters on there, um, and their last name was Holden. So that's where his name came from, and Levi just seemed to flow nicely with it. Um, first, I was kind of thinking and calling him Levi Holden, but then, like, for Luna and Levi, I just, I don't know. I am at the point where I don't want babies' names to start with the same letter sounds strange but that's kind of where I'm at so this is Holden I'm introducing to you this one Holden Levi um, real care 2 plus Caucasian male and I put his birthday as May 31st 2017 as Luna's is May 31st 2016 I had to think about that and I'm in, in to introduce to you this little guy his name is Destu Manny and as you can tell, he's my favorite um, Native American male, or my Native American sculpt, and he's a male, and he is in pristine condition. Like, he is in really, really good condition. Like I said, there's just a little bit of a, like, black on his nose, and I tried to get that off with the baby wipe, but it wouldn't come off. So I'm going to try um, a little bit of, uh, what's it called, the oxy tan on his nose. Um... His name, Dust You, I believe it was Cherokee. I know it's a Native American name. Um, I want to say Cherokee, meaning spring frog. Um, and, you know, I just, I kept looking at a bunch of different Native American names, and I would find some, and there was no way for me to figure out how to pronounce them. Uh, so... Dust you seems like an easy one to pronounce. Um, I had asked my Native American friend for some help, and she went to her tribe, and they couldn't really think of any names to help with him. And then um, my husband is actually part Cherokee, so I just started looking up Cherokee names, and that one seemed to, to suit, and I just thought it was cute, meaning spring frog. Frog has a certain meaning to my family, little frog. So, um, and Manny just seemed to flow with it. Um, I can't remember what Manny actually meant. It went with spring frog. And I am seriously drawing a blank. But this is Destu Manny and Holden Levi. And like I had said in the past with the baby names, um, I am kind of doing a theme with their names, so the boys get, um, uh, I'm drawing a blank right now, the boys get, like, heritage names for what their ethnicity is, and the girls, I'm just kind of having fun with their names, um, and... So I'm, I'm kind of like, I have name ideas for um, the ones that are coming. Or not that are coming, I should say. The ones, future babies that I'm missing. Um, like I have a first name for the Japanese girl. 
And I have, I think I have a name. I have a name, I believe, for the at least light Hispan or African American boy. Um, what I'm thinking with their names is for the light African American boy. I'm looking more of like a U.S. type African American name. And for the dark one, I think I'll go more with an actual African first name. Uh, I haven't fully decided that. And the Hispanic girl, I had thought about a name and I didn't write it down and I should have. And now I cannot remember it for the life of me. I had it. But that's enough rambling for their names. It's been about 10 minutes, so just went longer than I want to, so... Just wanted to introduce the two boys since when I did their box opening video, for the life of me, I could not even remember what I named them. My, yeah, I just haven't been getting enough sleep, so I just, my memory's been going lately. So I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will see you all later. Bye!